Hey guys, how's everything going? This is Jacer, who is not good at algorithms. Today, I'm going to take a look at uh, 101 symmetric tree. We're given a binary tree. Check whether it is a mirror of itself symmetric. For example, this tree up in the center, well, it's symmetric, but this one is not. Solve it both recursively and it, it, iteratively. Well, we, we are already told that there might be uh, several uh, approaches. The first one, let's take a look at the recursive one, okay? Well, the recursive one is, of course, as a symmetric tree, the left child must be symmetric to the right one, right? So, for the root node, well, itself must be symmetric. One node, okay, symmetric, cool. And then, left and right, it must be the same, and it must be symmetric. So, the value itself must be same, and its right must be symmetric to its right. Its left must be symmetric to the right, and the right must be symmetric to the left. So, we can do this recursively, right? Yeah, cool. They try to do it. Asymmetric root. And uh, we'll say is check uh, for the root there is only one it must be okay but we're actually comparing to different nodes right so uh, uh, like a node one and a node two we'll see if they are symmetric the first condition is if node one It might be a uh, null, right? Should we compare the null? Left, right. Yeah. If they are all null, it's okay. If it's null and node 2 is null, return true, right? And for the other case, one of them are not. So if node one is not null and node two equals null, then return false. If node 1 equals null and and node 2 is not null return false and the last case is that both of them are not null if node val it's not equal to node 2, well, then it's not symmetric, right? You turn return false. And now, if that's right, we will say if check node 1 left, node 2 right, return false. And if at last we will check the check node 1 right node 2 left so this is the actually the recursion function and the call would be return check root root right we check we check against itself for this case this will match this will match and then this will fail so force 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 if force return force and then return the last one. I think this should work. Let's try to... Hmm? Unexpected token. Ah, oh, typo, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, this is accepted. Let's try to analyze the time and space complexity. Time. We check it. 
and uh, check the next one and check the next one. So actually, all the nodes will be traversed in your time. And the space, there will be there will be actually uh, we check go to the straight so maximum it will be the depth right uh, it's a uh, worst case linear time average it should be log n so let's try to do it recursively Uh, iteratively, this is recursion. We compare each node, but for there's another way to 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 check this problem. Is that for each layer, there's one node, of course, symmetric. If this layer is two two, it's also uh, symmetric, and three four four three, it's also uh, symmetric. So the idea is that we get each layer. get each layer and check them right of course this will be uh, BFS graspers for BSF a BFS we create a queue and put the root in Uh, if 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 root is null, of course, it's uh, symmetric, right? And uh, uh, while Q is not empty, while well, there is layer, we will get the nodes out. And uh, of course, we will check if Q is symmetric, symmetric or not, right? We just uh, compare the first and the last and then next one and check them one by one zero let j equals q dot net while a smaller than j when they equal it's okay let is symmetric equals true if q i is not equal to Q I. It might be null, right? If uh, it's number, how can we check it? So. If both the, both of them are null, it's okay. Let's create a helper method. Method is equal node A node node two, and copy the code here. Return true. Yeah, we just say if it's equal, if it's not equal, we break, right? And we said, oh, we don't need to break, we just uh, return false. Return false. 
we don't need this flag and uh, don't forget to i plus 1 j minus 1 and so we check check it and then push the next layer right so this works simple we create cube push uh, there is a possibility of null let count equals q dot n while count is bigger than zero we will shift shift the node out right mm, cast head equals q shift push a node uh, pop uh, shift the node and push the left and the right in If head is not equal null, cube push head left, cube push head right, count minus. Yeah, this should do, right? At last, nothing happens, it should be true. Hmm? Val of non defined. Null, null, true. Not null, null, false. Null, null, mm. Vow of undefined. Count equals Q n. While count is there's count, we shift and then we push. Uh -huh. Why there is undefined? Oh. Minus one. I see. Try to submit. Cool. Or accept it. And for this one, for time, uh, we're actually push every node in and uh, check every node. And uh, with an extra, this comparison, this will ch actually check all the nodes again. So it's slightly worse than the previous one I think, but it's still linear. Space. We are we are going to store the layer, the node, this all the nodes of one layer. So its worst case will be it will be a full tree. Its worst case I think it should be n divided by two. It's still a linear time, a linear space. Worst. Well, so that's it. That's remember that for an iterative way of traversing the tree, create a queue, and the first we push the root in, and uh, using the nth like count counting technique or push a null and identifier, and uh, for every layer, like this is the layer while, and we get all the elements out and push. Oh, uh, here, here, sorry. This is the while loop for every layer. Get the element out and push their children in. Like get these two, get this, the, 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 queue, the queue will be two, two, right? Get first two out, push this four, three in, four in, and then get these two out, push the four in, three in. Yeah, that's all for this problem. Hope it helps. See you next time. Bye-bye.